weeks here in October, and we're just so grateful to get to do this life together and have um, just the abundance that we get to experience together. And so I'm a diamond in Young Living, and my journey has been so fun and so full of passion and so full of like ups and downs. And um, gosh, I would just love to share some of that with you today. So um, I was just fresh married when I found out for the first time that I was pregnant three months four months into our marriage found out that I was pregnant it was a total surprise we were actually planning to um to wait a few years to have children um but I got pregnant and we were so excited after we found out that we were pregnant we invited both of our families over to our house our little tiny one bedroom apartment and gathered everyone together and said hey, we want to get a group picture you know and told everyone and snapped the picture and it was just so great um it was it was really a beautiful time and so to a few weeks after we told our families what that we were expecting we actually had to go back and tell them that we found out that we had miscarried our pregnancy and that was really devastating because i was so healthy in my mind i mean i ate right and I worked out and I checked all the boxes that I thought were required for health and leaving my appointment that day I'll never forget just the complete devastation and feeling like there is something more to the health um, puzzle than that I don't know because this doesn't make sense my body is so designed for, I just believe that we were designed in perfection so I remember telling myself um, and just kind of looking up into the sky and seeing the beautiful clouds and just saying every single opportunity that I've ever had in life has been born out of some sort of disappointment or some some sort of trial and I'm going to look for that opportunity here even though it hurts and um, two days later I met the woman who introduced me to the oils I told her to send me her link. Her name is Jordan Trant. She's a Royal Crown Diamond now in Young Living. Um, I told her to send me her link. I bought my starter kit that day when we literally did not have money for it, but I was like, I need these products. And I started shifting into a more natural lifestyle. At that point, I literally was only using these oils for the products. I was not looking to have some sort of multi-million dollar business. I was not looking to change my you know, professional career idea. Um, literally it was just as simple as like, I want these oils and Jordan invited me to business presentations. She invited me to information, but really I was just respectfully declining every time because it wasn't for me at that time. And months later, well, about a year later, I was, we were so grateful. We had another little guy, another little baby. His name is Moses. This is my oldest now. He's almost six. And I, I remember thinking, this is motherhood. This is what I always wanted. This is the, uh, this is the baby that I'm going to make cute lunches for and send off to school. I'm going to have these Pinterest worthy birthday parties. I'm going to do the laundry and this is everything I ever wanted. But somehow I feel like there's a calling in my heart to do something in addition to this. And I, but I don't want to, I don't want to forget like this is my priority. And I felt like I had never seen an opportunity um, in a business sense that would encapsulate being able to be a mom and also be uh, in business. And at that time, my husband was working full time. And so it was just me and my little guy all the time, you know, me and my little baby all the time. And so I just decided, you know what, I'm going to go for it. And I started out by watching a ton of YouTube videos. I watched YouTube videos of, I would just type in Young Living Diamond and then just listen. I would, at the time there was Periscope and every time someone would go live, I would, I would open it up and listen. Um, and it was just the most amazing thing because I found this passion for something in addition to being a mom and wife. And it gave me an opportunity and what I call um, my friend Laura calls a window to the outside world. And it gave me this reason to better myself. And what I realized was as much as I am obsessed with my kids, <laughs> um, they are an extension of me. And if I'm not growing myself, if I'm not putting myself out there in the world, how can I expect my children to do that? How can I look in the eyes of my daughter and say, you're a world changer, but yet in my heart, 
not believe that about myself and, and hold back and stay safe and behind the curtain and make the cookies and send them out and hope they do the best thing for them, but not actually show them what it would look like in my life. And in my life, the things that were holding me back were all of the things that I would have to push through in order to be successful with this, this business. The fear of rejection, the fear of people saying, no, I'm not interested in what you're selling. The fear of people actually thinking I was crazy for doing some sort of network marketing thing. Those things were holding me back. The fear of um, imagining flopping at something, making a profession and saying, hey, uh, hey, babe, to my husband, hey, I'm going to do this thing. I'm going to go to Royal Crown Diamond and then falling flat on my face being vulnerable in my life, all those things were things that I was afraid of. And in order to actually play big and show my kids what it would look like to play big, I had to make a commitment to this, this thing. And if I'm honest with you, I could give you the strategies. I could tell you, here's the right words to say. I could tell you it's okay if people say no. At the end of the day, what's going to set you apart in this business is you deciding on a, if I can say guttural level that you are going to do this, deciding that you will succeed at this and figuring out, you know, you don't have no idea how long it's going to take. You don't know where your hookups, your, your hookups, your hangups are going to be. You have no idea where you're, where you're not going to, you know, find success or where you are going to be. We don't know all those things, but when you decide that you are going to do this, no one can stop you. And and that is a belief that will carry you through the ranks of this company and into your desired life. Because let me just shock you with some information right here. It is not um, it is not what you do. It's what you believe that will will determine your success. Now, is there a piece of it that's action? Absolutely. But I've seen people do all the right things. They take the right steps. They host the right classes. They invite the right people. They say the right words. And the reason why it's not fully thriving within them is because they haven't made a decision on a on a core level that they believe this business is possible for them. And so if I can just challenge you with that to make a decision today through the screen. I know it's not the same as being in a room full of energetic people who are saying, you can do this and screaming and having their hands up. I know it's not the same. But if this is your destiny, you will decide and you'll take the opportunity through the screen to decide that this is your mission and you will not fail because you will not give up. And friends, that will make you unstoppable in this business. <sighs> All right. I have so much more to say, but that's what I have for today. Have an amazing event and thanks for letting me hang out.